Alrighty, welcome back, guys. Instead of back with another video. Really? Okay. Alrighty, welcome back, guys. Instead of back with another video to another Naruto reaction. I'm super excited. But before we get started with the video, before we get started with the video, if you are new to the channel and you want to get up to eight episode early access or uncut reactions of Naruto, make sure to become a member. Third link down in the description. It literally says become a member right next to the link, so you can't miss it. And like I have promised, once we get to 250 members, which by the way we're less than 40 away now, I will start doing extra uploads of Naruto every single week. Currently, we do six episodes per week, and the plan is do anywhere from 8 to 10 so please thank you as well as we do have a sponsor on today's video is from the coldest water bottle this is actually not the first time that they're sponsoring this video this is probably like second or third time but if you have not already heard they have some of the best water bottles on the market honestly i'm not saying this of course i am getting paid i will be front with you guys like i have always said i am getting paid to talk about their products but the people over at the company are super chill and everything they just said give your honest opinion on it so yeah i will just say that yes it is one of like the quality on this thing like it might be a little expensive than you know what the current bottles you might find on amazon or something but the quality is worth it as well as their products are at they actually keep your drinks cold up to 36 plus hours and odor free so when you're out there doing exercise this and that and shit it doesn't smell okay and for me at least i don't know about you guys i don't like my water bottles sweating because especially when you're young like when you're exercising you're gonna sweat and when the odor gets on it it's not it's not a good time so yeah, if you want to go check them out, first link down there is for their website. As well as if you use code Neil on the checkout, I also, I would just say you get 10% off, but I also get a part of the revenue from it. Or if you want to enter in a giveaway, which they are doing on their website currently, it's the second link down in below. You know, just click on that, go check it out. You know, why not? It's free. Why the fuck not? <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. <laughs> What? Oh, is this is like drawing. Though. What? What does this mean? A man? <laughs> Look at her eyes. <laughs> what the? Oh, is that Kakashi? Uh, what? It's you? That has to be Kakashi, right? Oh, hey. what's up? Long time no see, huh? Looks like you've gone through a lot in this test. Hey, we, we almost wait, fucking what's the died, bro. <laughs> Why are you appearing with the summoning? At the end of the second exam, we tuning are supposed to welcome the test takers back. Then, well, it was just good luck that I got to be the one given the. So wait, like the all of the scrolls, they just had like teachers just hiding in the them or some shit. Of being the messenger for you guys, I would love to treat you all to some Ichiraku ramen, but uh. Ramen. Did you not chat? I literally just had Seriously? ramen. I still have the so bottle of Coca Cola. Cool. Right. <laughs> right, I'm not next done. So cool. Let go. Believe hey, Naruto. It. Oh yeah! <laughs> ramen would be awesome. <laughs> Especially after all the bugs and plants we've had to eat for the past two days. Oh. Hey, you can leave that out. <laughs> you can leave that out, Naruto. <laughs> if we had looked at the scrolls in the middle of the exam, huh? What would you have done to us, Iruka Sensei? Oh yeah. If a scroll was opened, we were ordered to knock out whoever opened it. Some ninja oh. found that out the hard way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a good thing you didn't open up yours, huh, Naruto? <laughs> heaven stands for your mind and earth for your body. If qualities of heaven are your desire, acquire wisdom to take your mind higher. Get it? Mm. Nope. Uh -uh. Alright, explain. <laughs> In other words, if your weakness lies in your intellect, Naruto, then you have to make doubly sure that you work hard to learn all the information and skills that you Takura, need. Takura, I know you're not doing this, bro. I swear to God, I will knock your teeth out, bro. I know, because I felt that same shit. It felt like he said that shit to me. If your weakness lies in your physical strength, Sakura, then you have to make sure that you work on your physical conditioning every single day so it improves all the time. She actually, nah, I'm not gonna lie, chat. I'm sorry for pausing so much so fucking much but Saku I, I was I was picking on her a while back or something because she wasn't doing nothing but she's proving herself bro is he like worried about him uh one more thing for the third exam don't push it too far especially you Naruto I worry Iruka sensei when I got this headband I stopped being a student so you don't need to worry about me <laughs> not anymore 
Look, I know their strengths and weaknesses better than anyone else does. Whatever the result, I want to be the one who breaks the news to them. Fine, if you're that hung up on it. Wait, those guys are Kakashi students, aren't they? Listen, if Kakashi's got faith in them, then I wouldn't count them out just yet, Iruka. Iruka needs to hear this. He needs to realize that they're not his students anymore. They're mine. And that's the simple truth. I get it. I, I feel like the thing is that I, don't, I can't blame, you know, like Iruka for being worried. It's more of like, it's not that he doesn't believe in Naruto. He just doesn't want Naruto to get hurt. You know what I mean? Like, it's, I feel like he sees Naruto as like a little brother or, you know what I mean? Like some, you know what I mean? How is it? Does the curse mark still cause you pain? No, not really. Thanks to you, it's much better. Oh, wait, he can... F so can he fix Sasuke? <sighs> He's a fan. He's inherited the sublime abilities of the Uchiha clan. Wait, so did he really just only come here with specifically Sasuke in mind or something? He's after Sasuke, right? What? Sasuke and his team have passed too! Well, of course they did. After all the trouble we went through to keep them safe, they better have passed. <laughs> You know it's crazy chat? He says all this shit, but he's such a fucking nice guy from inside. Like, he's like, this is pain in the ass. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do that. But like, he's genuinely fucking nice, bro. He dead ass put, like, put himself out bad, there to save Sasuke them. and everybody. They must have gotten real lucky. Of course, with my team still around, your team is doomed to failure. <laughs> hmm? Did you say something? <laughs> I love their rivalry, bro. <laughs> oh, they made it. Back for what you did to me, Sasuke. Ah, bro. <laughs> you want to get another hand broken? Ooh. Don't tell me, bro. No, 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 no. Something about this motherfucker, bro. No, 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 no. Go back. I was just about to say like, oh, he looks cool, but I think I, something about his eyes. I don't know what it is. It reminds me of uh, what was his name again? Fuck this, the snake guy. I forgot his name. Fuck, whatever it is. And the smile. <laughs> I knew she'd be doing this, bro. Thank goodness. <laughs> Many leaders and people of prominence from various countries are invited to attend this exam as guests and also possibly to seek Shinobi to work for them. This exam could determine the course of your ninja work from here on out. Yo, okay, there's like so much more to this shit. The country's strength is the village's strength. The village's strength is the shinobi's strength. And the true strength of the shinobi is only achieved when it's pushed to its limits, such as in a life and death battle. This okay. exam is a chance for each nation to display the strength of its shinobi and hence the strength of the nation itself. The third exam is a fight for life with the pride of your village and your own dreams at stake. He said a fight for life, bro. Um, Just tell me what the details of the exam are already. I can handle anything you throw at me. Mm. Yo, I well, kid you sure not, bro. Oh my god. I like his Any voice and is fine. Just tell me what the details Oh my are. god, bro. Look at the exam I mean, I said, look, hear his voice, bro. You throw at me. That shit, that ass, I don't know what it is. It matches his little face. It's nice to meet you all. <laughs> There's something I would like to Bro, <laughs> y'all. <young. laughs> Why does man look like he hasn't slept in weeks, bro? To do before the third exam. <laughs> 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 I get the feeling this man to pass out halfway through the exam. All right, that was actually a super fucking tight episode. I don't know how much I'm gonna keep in the video on the YouTube side of the thing, uh, but because like it was mainly just me being given information for me for watching for the first time, it was hella entertaining and I got like a whole different vibe. I mean, like there's so much more to the show, bro. It's not just like you're trying to get to the next level of a uh, uh, ninja, whatever the tuning. What you, Jesus Christ, how's that even very far? <laughs> you're just not just trying to get to that. Like there's people fucking trying. You know what I mean, like uh, it's like how do I put it? 
it's like a whole business world kind of in a way like you know you're there's also like higher ups like looking at you and depending on how what your abilities are how strong you are you might find better connections it, that could result into you finding more work maybe this and that like there's so much more to it and and i feel like like then and then there's a fucking villain in the uh what's his name again the snake guy who's also doing some shit which we have no clue what the fuck he, his actual goal is so far i know he's like trying to get his hands on sasuke or some shit but like how, what i'm confused about is that how did he because it seems like every time like they brought up even in this episode and when he was out there like it seemed like he was specifically targeting Sasuke, but like, how did he know about Sasuke? I mean, like, I don't know. Maybe we'll find out more in the future. But nonetheless, the dope episode. I just don't know how uh, how much I'm gonna put on the YouTube side of the thing because I don't know how entertaining it is for you guys to, you know, just listen to some dialogues happening throughout the whole episode. And you probably watched this show at least like once, if not two, three, four times. So we'll see. But nonetheless, super tight. I'm loving the show. Let's just move on to the next episode. The first and second exams might have been too easy. The fact is, we never expected so many of you to still be here. Yep. According to the Fair. rules of the Chunin exams, a preliminary round can be held at any stage in order to reduce the number of candidates remaining. Okay. So if there are any of you who feel you're not in top physical condition, now's your chance to... <coughs> Talk about not being in top <laughs> That proctor doesn't look so good himself. <laughs> Sorry about that. He reminds me of Eraserhead for some reason. Well, they pulled a fast one, but I'm in all the way, no matter what. I I'm kind of scared for Naruto because he did literally just like two episodes ago oh, fight yeah. all night. Uh, the winners will be determined by one-on-one -on -one combat, sudden death. Oh, I'm down for some fights. What do we do with him? We take him out of the exam, hand him over to Black Ops, and let them keep him locked up. We have to keep that seal under control. Oh, and Bitch, what? Just... Well, hold the fuck up. Why the fuck ain't you in that shit then, huh? It's going to quietly go along with all of this, huh? You really think so? If he stays, he's a danger to everyone. Don't you see? As he gets stronger, so does the curse mark. You you want to take that fucking mic off and then say it? You want to announce it to the fucking world, bro? Okay. Oh, it's time with the... You got me. I'm out. Huh? But, Kabuto... Okay, you can go on and step back. Gotcha. Kabuto! Ah, there's some. You can't quit! The fact is, ever since orientation and that dust up with the Sound Village team, I've had no hearing at all in my left ear. Oh, nah, he's lying. And now to have to put my life on the line? To fight again, right away without a break? Uh -huh. I can't do it. I feel like he literally does this shit just to collect information now. I Like, he literally gets here, collects all the information in the first two rounds, dips out on the third one, and then comes back the next year. Because if he won the exam, then he couldn't come back in the examination anymore. Do you remember the child? The one who was found after the Battle of Kikyo Pass? The only survivor? I remember the story. What kind of... It was said a small boy was found among the enemy dead on the battlefield. He was found barely alive and brought back by a Jonin from the medical unit. You're saying this is that boy? I swear to God. Let me find out that this motherfucker killed all of them. Wish I could stick around and play a little longer. But if I did that, the old me might get stirred up. I know it, bro. I know this I motherfucker know. killed all of those fucking dead people that they found him against, bro. You don't need me, do you, Lord Orochimaru? I fucking knew it, bro. I fucking knew it, bro. <laughs> now then, does anybody else want to quit? <laughs> don't say it, Sakura. Oh, I know I, I understand you, but no. Don't you fucking do it. <laughs> this has nothing to do with you. Told you before what I am is an Avenger. This is the path I walk. Not you or anyone can change that. Oh, Sasuke. Man, you don't know when to quit. What are you biting your head off for, you <laughs> idiot? It's just because she cares about you. Naruto. Huh? You're one of the ones I want to fight the most. What? Okay. 
I would actually fucking be down to watch that shit. I, I, would, I would just call it out a prediction time now that they mention it or something. Watch like them to be the last one to make it or something and they're gonna fight it out in the tournament and one of them is gonna win or some shit. There are 20 of you remaining, so that means we will need 10 matches. The surviving candidates from these 10 matches will advance to the third exam. As for the rules, there are none. We will yeah. fight until one dies or concedes defeat or is rendered physically incapable of continuing the contest. They really don't give a fuck about their lives, bro. All right now, those whose names have been drawn, come forward. Oh! This is going to be an interesting one. You have been chosen for the first match. Yoroi Okado and Sasuke Uchiha. Sasuke, good luck. Now we just sit back and see what happens. Oh, nah, bro. <laughs> Sasuke. Don't use your shotting gun. He knows. So you know about it. If that mark on your neck gets out of control, your life could be in danger. I'm aware of that. Just to let you know, if it gets to that point, I'll have to step in and stop the fight. Good luck. Okay. <laughs> stop the fight? I see what he did there. That's why I like it. Because he, he literally put Sasuke into a position like, yeah, you want to test yourself? You want to see who the strongest, this and that, blah, blah, blah. Guess what? Don't use it. Because if you do, I'm going to stop the fight and you won't get to do your shit. Every time I use my chakra, this thing gets a little stronger. It gains a little more control over me. So he just has to fight normally with like I martial arts, hand to hand. Without using my shotting gun. And even my own jutsu is off limits. Maybe I can make him laugh himself to death. <laughs> even just throwing normal shit, bro? <laughs> yo, yo, I fucking like this shit. What's he doing? <laughs> yo, <laughs> don't tell me, Sassy, oh, that ass gonna lose. My chakra, what are you doing? <laughs> They're gonna end the episode right there, bro. Are you still? I hate when shows do this. Like, either start the fight and finish it in one episode or or don't start it at all like don't start it at the end of the episode bro <laughs> i'm not gonna lie i have no idea what the fuck that guy's ability is he's like he, he's got like some type of fucking little thing on his hand and i don't know maybe the way he sasuke said what are you doing to my chakra or something that kind of gives me a clue into maybe he's like sucking it up or something or maybe like he's he's manipulating it to a certain point to maybe like that's what's paralyzing sasuke or something's going down Either way though, I'm fucking hyped because after these slow ep two slow episodes, which by the way, I'm glad that happened. Like I know a lot of the times, like I'll, as much as I like action paced episodes and stuff, I love these type of episodes because like we're given information that is much needed, at least for people watching it for the first time and stuff. Like, cause like I got so much insight into this and that and shit happening as well as I'm glad that Kakashi actually like, I don't know, Kakashi like, how do I put it? Kakashi does not hold his students back he, he supports them as much as he can but at, at the same time he's also like bro if it comes down to it i will stop it like if it comes to your you dying i'll do something about it you know what i mean but until then do your thing and i like that i like that it's like i, I don't know how to put it but at the same time i also understand uh what's his name uh fuck the other teacher the the fuck man all these names bro the other teacher that like respect uh, you that loves naruto pretty much you know i mean like i can understand his perspective as well you know i mean like you care for somebody of course you don't want them to get hurt this and that and stuff that's why i wasn't saying much when you know Sa sakura was telling you know sasuke to drop out this and that and shit because at the end of the day she does care for him you know i mean she just wants the best of for sasuke and you know it is what it is uh but yeah 
But apart from that though, remember if you are new to the channel, we do have eight episode early access on the channel for Naruto as well as uncut reactions. So if you did not see some of the parts that you might've wanted me to react to or something in this video, you can still check out the uncut version and it also supports me. It helps me put more uh, time and effort into this. I would appreciate it and yeah.